Hey everyone, welcome to a new video. I have found another free AI coder and believe me guys, after watching this video, you will be a pro level developer. So forget bold.new, forget lovable.dev. Use this AI coder and this AI coder can make any kind of interactive website within a minutes. So let's see that how much capability this uh, AI coder have. Here you see that I have these three prompt, prompt one, prompt two, prompt three. So prompt one is this e-commerce website that I will make uh, and prompt two is the interactive Apple watch operating system that I will make and prompt three is the notion mail clone. So I will make three websites with this uh, free AI coder and you will see that how much capability it has and also it uh, has this enhanced prompt capability. So many uh, AI coder also uh, same has the same features like enhanced prompt capability, but that is not powerful. But this AI coder uh, enhanced prompt capability is so much powerful that if you give any simple prompt also like build me a dashboard or build me a e-commerce website, this enhanced prompt uh, capability uh, can make any kind of simple prompt also or can modify any kind of simple prompt also in such a way that you will get a good looking modern interactive website within a minutes. Okay, so let's see step by step process. So first I will try this uh, prompt one. Prompt one is this create a multi vendor e-commerce marketplace with product listing and user reviews. Design a seller dashboard for managing products and orders. So I will copy this prompt one and I will paste it here and I will click on this enhance prompt and you will see that uh, it will modify that prompt. Here you see that with the details, it has added many details like create a multi vendor e-commerce marketplace featuring product listing with images, description, user reviews. Additionally, design a seller dashboard that allows vendors to manage their products, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so that means it has added many things uh, with my prompt. Okay, now let's see that uh, here you see that uh, they have added one another thing which is a thing. So if you have any complex prompt, then also you can press this thing so that you will get the better uh, good looking website. But for the timing, I, I am not pressing this thing. Click on this enter. And now you see that uh, it has started generating the website. And till the time it is generating the website, in the meantime, let me show you here you see that uh, some of the extra exciting cool features it has. So on the right hand side, it has this deploy button and also it has this share button. That means you can share it with anyone and also this add to code base. So this add to code base feature is actually very good. So if you click on this add to code base, here you see that uh, you will find this uh, comment npx hero ui cli. Uh, okay, if you copy this command and if you run this command on your terminal, then the whole code base will be added to your um, to your editor. Suppose you are using this cursor or windsor or VS code, you just simply copy this and uh, just run it and it, the whole code base will be added to your uh, editor. And also alternatively, you can download it as a zip file and you can import that or extract that. Uh, in your code uh, editor. Now here you see that I got the output and uh, this is the feature products. Uh, they have added all of these images also and they have also added this rating, this pricing and this product names and also uh, here you see that they have added this filter option, this sort option and also on the right hand corner they have added this seller dashboard because I asked uh, for that also and also there is a search product option now if i click on any of the products here you see that uh, this is the product description and uh, the product categories pricing add to cart option save option and this description and this reviews option here you see that for the review uh, they have added some dummy reviews and uh, the images means the person who have given the images their images also added the timings all of these things are got added and also now on the right hand corner you see that there is a seller dashboard so now if i click on the seller dashboard okay so it is a cool looking seller dashboard also like uh, on the left hand side there is a dashboard products and orders so here you see that if i go to this products they have added all of the products 
and uh, also there is a edit button that means i can edit this product also now if i go to these orders here you see that all of the orders and their status uh, this pending processing delivered all of these things are here and now again back to this dashboard and here you see that recent orders and this um, sales overview and this total sales products customers all of the things they have added with a single prompt you see guys with a single prompt they have added all of these things now again back to this product and here you see that uh, there is a edit and delete option so let me click on this edit let's see it is working or not okay it is not currently working now for that i have to tell it that uh, please um, yeah, please make it functional this edit button you will get this preview option here you see that uh, desktop tablet and this phone okay and also it is responsive and uh, here you see that uh, beside the preview you will find this uh, this code option where you, you will find all of your code and beside code you will find the console so all of the console you will find see console logs okay all of the console logs you will find here so it is actually amazing guys and also versioning are there here you see that previous version next version are there so you can go to your previous version also uh, if you uh, found any error in your current version you can always back to your previous version right now let me tell you the website name here you see that the website name is herouy.chat this is the website and the link is given in the description box if you open that link you will find this kind of ui and on the right hand side you will find a uh, sign in button so click on the sign in and there you will find option like sign in with github or sign in with your google account uh, do whatever you prefer this hero ui has a another website which is the hero ui.com this is the official uh, website and you see that make beautiful website regardless of your design experience so many of you already know about the material ui or sad cn ui or chakra ui okay so these are the popular ui uh, provider which have some cool components that we can use in our website some built-in okay previously built-in components they have and this hero ui also has some built-in components and uh, if you click on this get started uh, here you will see that on the left hand side it has all of these components like accordion autocomplete badge avatar calendar button okay and uh, now they have introduced this hero ui chat to build any kind of website and they have also uh, used their own hero ui uh, library okay now let's move to our next prompt so here you see prompt 2 create a fully interactive apple watch operating system style ui with smooth animations and seamless navigation between the apps the design should be mirror the modern sleek and fluid experience of watch operating system so if i take you to the watch operating system here you see this is the official website you will find this type of cool looking ui and you can make also with this hero ui dot chat so basically if i take you to this uh, twitter this person have built this watch operating system clone on this hero ui chat and it is mind blowing beautiful animations beautiful design perfect implementation and here you see that um, this is the prompt he has used and i have copied the same prompt uh, this prompt i have given in the description box also you can copy this and you can provide it with the uh, uh, hero ui so that you can make exactly the same thing okay and uh, this is the website link here you see that wwc cfg3 and i have copied this website link and i have opened it in my uh, own computer system and here you see that this is the ui what he has already made so if i click on this phone and this is the phone all of these things gets appear if i click on these messages here you see that all of these messages and uh, this mail and uh, and and all of this mailed if i open any single mail also here you see that this documentation pdf means whatever this person got from other person and this calendar and this uh, music here you see that all of these things is working fine perfectly and you he has made this uh, kind of ui with this hero ui chat so i have this uh, i have given this person's post link in the description if you go to that link 
there also you will find this post basically he has posted this one minute video and he has uh, shown us that what he has made okay so the same thing that you see and i will give this uh, website link also in the description box so basically this is the website link okay now let's move to our prompt 3 which is the notion mail clone so if you go to the notion official website here you see that so we all know about the google mail but many of you don't know about the notion mail so it is basically the same as the gmail or google mail here you see that this is the interactive ui on the left hand side you will find this uh, search inbox calendar and all of these things and on the right hand side you will find the uh, mails okay hero.ui uh, official twitter post and here you see that they have made the exactly same thing notion mail clone and uh, on the right hand side here you see that this is the ui and this is the website link you see guys my 45 pn and i have copied this website and i have opened it on my local uh, machine here you see this is the website link and you see that on the left hand side we have some options like the google mail this all mail sends drops settings option is there templates trash and on the right hand side you see that all of the mails that i got it it is uh, currently uh, visible and this checkbox option is there and this trash option here you see that it is actually working like the gmail or mail uh, or the outlook that we use on our daily basis and on the right hand side there is a this level option is there and many options are there so you can actually modify this so if i open any of the mail on the right hand side you see that uh, this exactly cool looking ui we got there is a reply and forward button are there okay so it is actually amazing means you can uh, actually create any type of cool looking ui uh, with this hero ui or chat okay and all of these prompts and all of these websites link are given in the description box so you open all of these websites and take the ideas and uh, always use this um, prompt enhance option so that your prompts get better features and uh, all of the modern uh, looking ui okay so please use this and let me know your thoughts in the comment section and uh, if you have not watched the other videos also till now that i have published like free ai coder with this gemini 2.5 flash and this client and root code combination and this codex cli from this open ai and this Cork studio gpt 4.1 and uh, if you have not watched all of this please watch this you will get a better idea that what is going on and what are the new things that came up in the last week and uh, it is going on guys and another thing i forgot to mention that um, in hero ui uh, dot chat uh, you will get five to six credits uh, daily means the five to six messages daily for free but if you want to get the higher rate limits now in that case here you see that uh, you have to give 20 dollar per month but for free users you will get this five deployments per month and five messages per day okay